Okay. <laughs> here we are. <laughs> we're, we're getting ready to take off here. It's uh, September 1st, 2018. We're at Olali Lake. It's uh, a challenging place to get to. Quite the, quite the gravel road up here. Got beautiful Olali Lake and Mount Jefferson in the background. And we're going to go for a hike. Are you going to go for a hike? What do you have? He's got a hiking stick. He is all set here. Well, so are you the youngest PCT hiker today? Yeah. I think so too. Wow, I like your walking stick. I think you could really do some things with that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're into kind of a interesting spot on the trail with a shale rock. Big slabs here. Really interesting. Well, we've come out to what we believe is Upper Lake. These are just beautiful alpine lakes. Well, here's some of the pretty fall colors in the bushes as we go through. We're going through some beautiful wildflowers here. We're not sure what they are. We have an app, we'll have to check it out. And they're beautiful. Well, we're going across a big rock face here it's impressive. Look at that. That is amazing. Wow. We'll be there by dinner time. By dinner time, yeah. Wow, this is really good. Well, we're on a boulder patch here. We're thinking this may be the biggest rocks we've ever had to climb on. and two peaks that were this close here that we've nicknamed Dan's Dome and Christine's Crimson Cone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those names probably won't stick, but it's a nice thought. I like them. Well, we're going up a really steep, rocky place here, heading up towards Jefferson Park. Or at least where we'll be able to get head downhill into that. Well, we are in an amazing rock pile here. Going up, up, up. It's real steep. Tough going. Okay, here we go. Up past the snowbank. We can see the what hopefully is the top of this pass coming up here. And Christine decided to just pile some rocks up while we were here. Just in my free time. Like Legos. And now look what we have behind us though. It's, uh... Oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, wow. That is stunning. Well, we're coming down from the divide. We've passed a number of people going up and some of them are really struggling. <laughs> it is. And a big rock pile scramble down off of here, but going downhill is not too bad. All right, we're coming up on the lakes now in Jefferson Park. There's quite a few of them down here. And this is a beautiful place. Well, here we are walking through Jefferson Meadows or Jefferson Park. I think we've been well this is Whitewater Creek which is really kind of interesting it's got all the glacial sediment so it really is white amazing all right we're going to cross a little bridge here So just looking up here on Mount Jefferson, really amazing sight. 
Okay, here's Christine crossing the stream. Looks like she's doing pretty good. Okay, well we just have crossed Mill, Milk Creek, one of the tributaries off of Mount Jefferson. Pretty little creek. There's quite a few PCT people here just soaking their feet and chilling out. This is a nice place. It's a gorgeous day. And this is beautiful Shale Lake. Well, it's windy here, it's going to be hard to hear, but we're looking down into the beautiful lakes basin here, down from Shale Lake. Off in the distance we can see the Three Pyramids, Coffin, I think it's Coffin Butte or Coffin Mountain, where I've been hunting before. And then we're getting just a little bit of a glimpse of Three Finger Jack off in the distance. So anyways, beautiful, gorgeous place here. Okay, turns out this is the Cathedral Rocks here. Getting a nice view of that up, up above Hunts and Hanks Lake, Lakes area. Really, how steep it is. It is really, really steep. I'm going to just kind of pan down here. Amazingly steep, kind of almost cliff-like here. Christine, can you hold up all three of those trees? Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're on the other side of the cathedral. Oh yeah. This yeah. is absolutely an amazing viewpoint here. It's like a big basin in to the east of the cathedral rocks and then on up into Mount Jefferson Country. Now it is. Okay. Number three. All right, we're going to try this again. All right, we have come into Rock Pile Lake. I'll pan around and show this. We're glad for this because we, this is our last water source on the trail for about 14 miles. If we want more water, we'll have to go off trail tomorrow. So we're hoping not to do that. So we're cooking up dinner here tonight. It's going to be beef stew tonight. Yeah, that should be good. It was a little bit windy earlier here, so we've got our tents stake down hopefully we'll have a good night it it did not get real cold last night we thought it would get into the 30s but it actually stayed right around 50 so not too bad well it's labor day 2018 we're on the trail we're just crossing to the east of rock pile mountain and an absolutely gorgeous morning here Enjoying the views out towards the Sisters, Mount Washington, Broken Top, Black Butte. A little bit of smoke settling in in the low country here, but it's beautifully clear up here. More views of Wasco Lake and some other lakes there too, little lakes kind of to the south of it. Really a beautiful area. Okay, here we go, making our way up to Porcupine Rock here. And we're still switch backing up here. This is pretty intense. Hey, <laughs> we're at the top of the world here. Woo. That was quite a climb up out of there. 
for 6,500 feet. Yep. That's pretty high for the PCT. It is. Felt higher. Okay, red buttons, okay. Chris. Well, we made it. This is uh, day three of a 45 mile hike. The Lolly Lake to San Yam Trailhead. It's been a great hike. Anything to add to that, Christine? No, Josh was a trooper. <laughs> you only did one, didn't you, huh? <laughs> Uh, it's uh, it's been great. We're glad to, glad we did it. It was pretty pretty tough, but incredible scenery. So we're really glad.